Okay, part two of Australian beef versus American beef, a topic you didn't know you needed to know about, but you do. Now we'll cover the grass-fed versus industrial feedlot. Okay, so approximately 97% of Australia's cattle are grass-fed and raised exclusively on pasture land. 90% of US beef, on the other hand, is raised on industrial feedlots. So only about 4% of beef sold in the US is grass-fed beef. So now we need to get to what actually qualifies something as grass-fed beef. The USDA actually dropped their legal definition standards and inspections of grass-fed beef in 2016. So there is a huge demand for grass-fed beef in the U.S., but domestically produced cattle just can't meet it. The vast majority of what is labeled grass-fed beef is actually sourced from Brazil, Uruguay, Australia, and then sold as a product of the USA. I feel duped. Okay, number six is herd size. So the average size of a beef herd per farm in Australia is 805, and the average size of a beef herd per farm in the U.S. is only 43. And number seven, a fun organic fact. Australia leads the world in land committed to certified organic farming. Half of the world's 74.9 million hectares of organic land.